As Official Secretary to the Governor-General, it is my respectful duty to read the following proclamation issued by His Excellency the Governor-General. Proclamation. Whereas by Section 57 of the Constitution, it is provided that if the House of Representatives passes any proposed law and the Senate rejects or fails to pass it, or passes it with amendments to which the House of Representatives will not agree, and if after an interval of three months, the House of Representatives in the same or the next session again passes the proposed law with or without any amendments which have been made, suggested or agreed to by the Senate, and the Senate rejects or fails to pass it or passes it with amendments to which the House of Representatives will not agree, the Governor-General may dissolve the Senate and the House of Representatives simultaneously. And whereas the conditions upon which the Governor-General is empowered by that section of the Constitution to dissolve the Senate and the House of Representatives simultaneously have been fulfilled in respect of the proposed laws entitled Building and Construction Industry Improving Productivity Bill 2013, Building and Construction Industry Consequential and Transitional Provisions Bill 2013, Fair Work, Registered Organisations Amendment Bill 2014. Now, therefore, I, Governor General, the Honourable Sir Peter Cosgrove, do by this my proclamation dissolve the Senate and the House of Representatives at 9 a.m. on Monday, 9 May 2016. Signed and sealed with the Great Seal of Australia on 8 May 2016, Peter Cosgrove, Governor General, and by His Excellency's command, Malcolm Turnbull, Prime Minister. <laughs> 